Hey guys, it's Renee. So for this DIY, I'm going to be using this empty coffee cans. I'm just recycling some clean and empty coffee cans. If you don't drink coffee or if you don't have them, they have a bunch of them online. If you want to go for this one, using my super glue, gluing one on top of the other. First, adding the glue on the edges and then placing them on top as fast as I can. To be extra secure, I'm going to be adding super glue outside the edges like this. Then I'm going to be using some twine, my hot glue gun. I tried doing this with my super glue, by the way and it didn't work out wrapping my twine all over this the first wraps that i do i'm gonna be adding uh, glue all over them just so that they are secure and they don't move and then the rest like the middle part i'm gonna be adding a drop of glue on three spots and then just place my twine in there that's because glue on like those three spots it's enough to just hold the twine you don't need to add more i'm gonna be shaping my twine as i call it like going with my scissors and then just cutting the like excess of this some twines more modern day ones don't have this they're kind of like more delicate ones mine is pretty old i think it's like 15 plus years old an old school one obviously and it has like a lot of this ones then i'm going to be using my sharpie and my ruler and i'm going to be marking one and a half inch that's going to be like the thickness of each stripe then i'm going to be using black and white acrylic paint first painting the white stripes every other stripe white and the brush that i'm using by the way i do have the diy for this one if you want to check it out it's actually really easy to make because it's white and i can kind of see the twine underneath i'm going to be doing three coats of this one then i'm going to be doing every other stripe black and i did two coats of this one just because black is more dense obviously than white and you don't need as much but yeah, this is what it looks like by itself. I love it. I love how rustic looks. As a huge black and white stripe lover that I am, I love it. I find black and white stripe patterns real classic and timeless, but it's just well. Using this block of foam and this fake plant that I bought a long time ago at Hobby Lobby. It's actually really easy to make, pretty affordable, and I love it. I don't think you can tell that these are empty coffee cans, but yeah, hopefully you like it too. If you did, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Check out other affordable home decor that I have and share this. Thank you so much for watching. I'll talk to you later and take care. Bye.